Hello everyone, and welcome to this unboxing video for Privateer Press's Mini Crate in the month of August 2018. So, I don't know what this one is off the top of my head. I think I know what it is, and this might be one of the for a few models that I already own, but from the sculpt that, if, that I remember of this model, as in I'm having trouble remembering if it's this box, I don't care. It's beautiful. Ooh, there's more than, okay, I was wondering what else was shaking around in here. So, first off, before I get to the actual model, again, whichever one that is, this was unexpected, I got a limited edition pin. So, they do uh, collect pin trades, that's literally what it says on the back, but this one's really nice. Uh, I can't remember the name of it, but this is a very specific weapon that is basically, the person wielding this is calling the apocalypse. Um, the original leader of the Trollkins was walking around with it. I think in his third form, he doesn't have it anymore, and he lost his arm in order to get rid of it, and didn't grow back. Okay, this is not what I thought it was, but I'm still happy to have it. Oh, that's cute. So there's a surprise membership gift. Uh, I'm not going to turn around because it's a code, but $5 off your next VIP um, membership. Okay. That's like 7%. Eh, whatever. If I remember to apply it, that's great. So this one is Gaston Crossbones is based on Gaston Cross. I'm actually not sure who that is. I remember seeing images of this now, and I'm just like, I, I have no idea of who this is or who it's based off of, but I'm always thankful for it. And this, this looks fucking awesome. Uh, I'm guessing he is still a pirate, and the, this isn't just one of the, like, he's just not made to look like a pirate, but I could be wrong. He's both the skull and crossbones. Uh, he's clearly from War Machine, and that's all I know. Uh, I have fallen behind on some of this stuff. Oof. <laughs> Almost lost his hat. Why did they make his hat a separate piece? Okay. I think this is one of the... Yeah, this is definitely one of the things involving more pieces from a mini crate that I've seen before. So, small size model. Here is his body, which includes majority of him. The Arcane Turbine Pack, his legs, you know, his lower body, and one of his shoulders and his head. Then we have his arm that is the other shoulder, as I believe would be a main gouge, or no, he just wields a pair of daggers. Uh, the artwork looked like it was a uh, main gouge and a sword, or something like that. Um, and then here's the other arm that doesn't have the shoulder, with same size dagger. When you hold them up next to each other, it's pretty obvious. And then a tricorder skull and crossbones hat. Not that you can see the skull and crossbones that well. But that seems to be it. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, feel free to press the like button. If you think somebody else will enjoy this, feel free to share this video. If you didn't like this video, go ahead and press the dislike button. I won't mind, but please leave a constructive comment as to why. Also, feel free to comment in general. If you want to hear my thoughts on any of the Iron Kingdoms, War Machine, Hordes, or anything like that, go ahead. And if you want to see more like this, be it my unboxing videos, my board game overview videos, or my painting videos, which I will be eventually posting it. I have recorded one of these mini crate models being painted, so eventually it will get up there. Or anything else that you want to see on my channel, feel free to subscribe. Regardless, thank you for watching, and have a wonderful day. Bye-bye.